welcome back i'm almost ready to go it's monday and i'm gonna vlog the whole day today the last couple of vlogs have been a couple of days together or the weekend and i just kind of felt like doing just one day from start to finish so it's monday morning it's just around nine o'clock i'm just getting ready now to shoot some instagram content i have to do some stories for a hair brand i'm going to be working with which is really exciting but i also just looked in the mirror and the bags under my eyes this morning i don't know what's going on i just haven't really been sleeping very well the last two nights like i'm luckily someone who once i get to sleep i sleep through the whole night i've always been like that i'm a really like deep sleeper but the last two nights i've been waking up so much throughout the night on saturday i woke up i think four times throughout the night which is just not usual for me so i think you can definitely see it <laughs> even under the concealer you can see the evidence this morning so take no notice of that hopefully i'll get back on track now this week but i'm gonna just bring you along for the day it's also international women's day today by the time this goes live it will obviously be over but just a big shout out to all you incredible women who follow me and honestly just sometimes i have to take a step back and like be so thankful for the community that i've built here and you know of course every now and again there's the odd nasty comment or someone just taking out their frustrations on me but like 99 percent of the messages i get and of you who follow me you just couldn't be more supportive and there's not one day i take that for granted like i'm just really proud of the community that we've built here and on days like today it's just it's just nice to kind of take a minute to acknowledge that so happy international women's day maybe me and kill and mom will do something nice later to celebrate so i'll bring you along for the day i'm in my class that robe you'd swear i just came out of a massage or something remember in the last vlog they gave one of these to me kill and our mom for the mother Thursday afternoon tea and wow these are the coziest thing and I was actually just thinking this morning you know how much I love my skims robe I wear it so much I think this is more comfortable this is like a whole new level of fluffiness and coziness like it's this material like full way through so it's that like cotton wool <laughs> feeling you know it's like so soft like you're just wrapped up Ugh. So nice so i've been wearing that every morning while i'm getting ready but anyway i'll get dressed now do my instagram content and and then i'll check back in. the brows are looking a little bit better aren't they they're still a tiny bit dark but they're definitely not as dark <laughs> as they were so yeah okay so dressed and we're ready to start the day i made another coffee <laughs> probably didn't i probably should have waited a while but it's kind of like i don't know what, how to describe it but you know, you have to sit down to do some work. It's kind of like an incentive to do it if I have a coffee. Does anybody else do that? It's like something to get you in the zone. Just my usual iced Americano. And I put on this new jumper from my last video, the Kildare Village one from Eleven Tea. It's so soft and so nice. And I have lots of my Lulary jewelry on this morning. These are the bleaker earrings. These are actually sold out, but they should be back all going well in a couple of weeks like maybe end of March, start of April, we're just working on getting them in as fast as possible. I love these so much. I think you can add your name to the wait list right now if you want to be like notified when they come back in. And then of course, our classic Mercer. This is like our hero product from the collection. This is the locket, just in case you haven't seen, but it opens up into a locket and you can put a picture in and it's just really one of these beautiful pieces. And we do still have a limited amount of these left, I think, until our next restock. I'm hoping it will keep us going to the restock because I, I like when things are just available all the time on the site. But even if it sells out in the next couple of weeks, we'll be getting more in, like ASAP. So yeah, this is the mercer if you're on the search for anything so i'm gonna get to work now um i did my instagram content that's done so i had to do some stories and take some pictures i'm gonna do a bit of admin um it's just about I don't know, half ten <laughs> I got through a lot of emails and just before I get back to filming and I need to have lunch and everything I want to show you something that I've started using recently and as you know I'm an ambassador for Spotlight Oral Care and I love their stuff like truly it's incredible I did the strips again I told you that in a recent vlog I did the 14 day strips again the results just speak for themselves 
this is my teeth today it just like brightens them up and as you know i'm such a big coffee drinker like i do need to keep on top of them and every time i use the strips that was my second time now the results and i see it straight away i see it in pictures people say it to me in person i had one of my aunts she was like messaging me the last day and she just bought them she wants to try them they really are so good so i've them done but one other product i started using from them recently i just brought it out out of my bathroom to show you because the light's better out here but it's their water flosser and i'll be completely honest i didn't really know what a water flosser was until i got to know spotlight oral care i always just did the you know the regular traditional floss and i'm actually very into flossing because i have a bit of crowding at the top of my mouth on my right side so i really have to be very on top of my flossing or else there'll be plaque build up and i could have issues so when the girls at spotlight told me about their water flosser i wanted to give it a go to see if it would be easier than the traditional flossing because sometimes with traditional flossing it's great but it can be hard to get into certain areas and really deep clean like really get that bacteria you know in certain parts of your mouth and flossing is so important i know it can be a pain to do but it really helps in the long term if you keep on top of it so the water flosser i started using this and i'll pop in a little clip of me using it now you just fill it up with water it's really simple and easy and you start from the back of your mouth kind of all along your gums and the water just comes out and you have to kind of lean over the sink because the water does come out of your mouth the first couple of times using this like full transparency it's a bit of trial and error but then once you get the hang of it it's incredible so this along with their electric toothbrush along with their toothpaste i just truly have never had a better oral care routine than i do now and i'm really enjoying this product and it comes with four different heads so this is the one i use i think it's just their kind of um like general kind of one that they recommend like their normal one and then if you have braces or if you have other like things you're kind of worried about there's different ones you can use and they also have a tongue scraper which is really important i use this a lot i think we don't realize how much bacteria lives on our tongue we're so focused on cleaning our teeth but our tongue is a disaster as well so it's really important to clean that and before i would just use my toothbrush sometimes and clean it but this is 10 times better so you can just attach it on there you charge it back here the water goes at the bottom it's so simple and easy once you get used to it so if you just need to up your flossing game or if you have braces maybe or just like certain areas that you really need to keep on top of or just in general you want to keep on top of your oral health definitely look into this my code retro works on it so that code works in the usa canada uk and ireland it works across all the markets so code is retro if you want to check it out and let me know if you have any questions as well i'm always here to help so that's my little dental hygiene talk of the day i wanted to share it in this video because i shared it on my instagram over the weekend and people were really interested in it like i got lots of questions which was great and i'm always just happy to share you know the different products from spotlight because we all know they have a toothbrush and strips but they have loads of other ones as well and this is another gym so yeah that's right. it okay, now time for a little bit of lunch we're gonna take five minutes because i'm starving happy international women's day thank you Erica. we're gonna have a little lunch now chill make another coffee and then get back to work also update on the machine we love it so so good A nice day sunny one minute drizzling rain the next it's actually heavy raining a minute but it's kind of calmed down hopefully it'll clear up now for a walk later okay i was actually gonna sit down and film this part of the video like separate in a whole separate video also hopefully it won't be too loud the cars on the road but i'll be quick but i'm gonna show you my sunglasses i have home with me i've been getting some questions recently over on my Instagram, I guess because the weather's getting a bit nicer now and it is nice to have a few good pairs and you know I love my sunglasses. So I have three designer pairs to show you and then one pair 
that people probably ask the most about and they were the cheapest pair like literally such a bargain so i'll share those with you as well i get lots of questions about them and you'll actually be shocked at the price and the quality is really really good like i'm not usually one for buying like very inexpensive sunglasses because i like them to be good quality but i'm so impressed with these ones so i'll get to them but first i'll show you the designer ones and then i'll show you the the bargain pair this video is just a complete mix of things but this is something i was actually really meaning to do so i feel like why not just show it to you now okay so the first pair i want to show you are these ones from ysl also ignore the nails you know we're going past that stage now they're just they're not going to be good until i can go get them done professionally um okay so these are the ysl ones you have the logo at the side they're kind of like a round frame and this part is quite thick so i'll show them to you on oh, now i love these i've had these i think for definitely going on two years at this stage and they've held up so nicely they're really good quality they're not too heavy on the face there's one pair now i'll show you next they're a little bit heavier whereas these are very light to wear like you wouldn't really even know you had them on and then they just have the subtle logo at the side which is really cool so that's the first pair and i'm pretty sure all of these are still available so i'll link them down below if i can find any and also they're all black they're all black with some of them have a touch of gold, but that's just the kind of sunglasses I like. Next up are actually another pair of Saint Laurent. So these ones just have a very, very subtle logo at the side. It just says Saint Laurent, like it's not flashy, it's not in your face. And these are more square frame. These ones are the ones that are a little bit heavier, but these are sturdy. And like I wear these a lot of times going for a walk when I go for a walk on the beach because they just protect your whole face. They're just a good size and they stay on really nicely. Like these ones do not budge. Like no matter what you do, they don't budge. They just fit really well and sit really well. Love these. And I would say these are probably the ones I've worn most when I'm home in Ireland. I, I always wear sunglasses even when it's even when it's kind of dreary because my eyes are very sensitive. Like they water really easily. So it's kind of more like to protect my eyes more than anything. And then if it's like bright even today it's not sunny but it's bright and my eyes are kind of squinting so it's just yeah i just like wearing them so that's the second pair Saint Laurent. i actually probably should have given these a bit of a clean before i did these but just pretend they're they're spotless that's the first two and then the third pair is actually a brand new pair so i got these i've been searching for these for so long and they were sold out they were sold out i even went on to like some secondhand websites to see if i could get them secondhand but they were like way more expensive that's what happens when something is really popular like if you don't get it when it comes out you'll actually end up paying more for it but i finally got them on farfetch recently these are them oh they are so Stunning. So I didn't have a pair like this and I used to borrow a pair that Kaylin had Loads when I was back in New York So I figured you know what I'm gonna get my own pair and I've seen lots of people get these and they just look very snazzy Very chic. So like for styling with outfits and stuff now I kind of wear them like this and then obviously normally <laughs> They look like this and they have the B B at the side. These are Balenciaga and I saw that they came out with like a square like more square no sorry rectangle version as well i'm not sure if they're vintage or if they're a new season but i've seen a few people with them but i really like this shape as well and just a little close up so you can see so these are new seasons so i'll be able to link these for you and yeah let me know what you think okay here are the pair i was raving about so straight away now these feel much lighter like the quality it's not bad for the price i mean it's very good for the price actually but like comparing it to the designer sunglasses like you can see why these are cheaper and these are more expensive like i am big into quality but these basically are very very similar to a pair that celine came out with and i searched high up and high down for those celine pairs of sunglasses and i just couldn't find them anywhere and again it was one of those situations that they were on the secondhand websites but i wasn't paying double the price for them i just i can't i would never ever justify that so i saw a girl i follow julia havens she linked these one day and actually when she put them on first i was like oh they're the celine they're so nice and then she linked them and they're from amazon <laughs> literally amazon sunglasses but look at the shape like they're such a nice shape in a sun in sunglasses they're just like a really nice size on your face and then at the side here it kind of like is a bit thinner and then it goes thicker 
these sit really nicely. I love styling these now with outfits and stuff. Like if I was out for a walk, I'd wear one of my better sunglasses because they're just better quality, but these are really cool just for styling up and for photos and everything. So yeah, get on it, Amazon. I'll put the link down below. It was the US Amazon, but I'm pretty sure you'll be able to get that delivered everywhere. I don't know how that works. It actually has been confusing me since I got home. Cause like Ireland Amazon is like different. Some things you can only get on US and Ireland, but I'll link as many, I'll link both options if I can find them below. Such a good find. I actually think I might get a second pair of these now to have for the summer. And like they hold up pretty well. I've worn these loads and they still look good. Like they are light. Don't expect something super heavy and like strong quality, but they do the job. Yeah, and they're really like the Celine ones. So there are my sunglasses. Kind of a random little insert into the video, but as I said, I was gonna sit down and film a separate video, but I figured I'd put it into the vlog because to be honest, I actually like filming vlogs better. I find I'm just much more natural and myself sometimes with those sit down videos i hype myself up too much <laughs> before i do them and they're very kind of proper whereas with the vlogs i'm literally just like these are the sunglasses <laughs> it's just a bit easier and more kind of um natural i suppose whatever so yeah hopefully you enjoyed that i'm gonna get back to work now and i actually do have to film one more video though besides this i have to actually find something i might do a fashion one i haven't done a fashion one in a while and yeah i'll be back to you soon also, I actually want to just say one thing as well. A few comments that I really, they kind of really stood out to me in the last video in the comment section when I was reading through. And lots of you said that you found my videos really like positive and uplifting. And honestly, that meant the world to me when I was reading the videos because, you know, obviously we're all going through such a strange time and some days you're in a good mood, some days you're in a bad mood. <laughs> and it's very, very hard to stay positive, like especially coming into the second year of this now it's like almost a full year since coronavirus happened and our lives all changed so it's just I'm so happy that I'm able to provide like 20 minutes of your week through my vlogs or through a video just to give you a bit of a lift and positivity and just know as well that I'm not always positive I'm a human like there's days I'm literally like do not put the camera near me <laughs> I am not in the mood to talk to anyone today, especially not a camera. But the majority of the time, I do try my best to just keep positive and look at look for all the positives in a situation. That's all you can do, and there'll always be challenges and there'll always be obstacles. And some days things will come at you, and you're just like, "What is going on?" And are things ever going to get better? But just always try your best to keep looking for the positives. And you know, I say this loads, but the more you focus on the good the more good that will come. I, I'm a big believer in that. So yeah, I just wanted to say thank you for those lovely comments. It really meant a lot to me. Hey guys, it's now the evening. We're going for a drive. We were actually gonna go for a walk, but look at this weather. So like such a change from this morning, but we're gonna go for a drive anyway, our daily visit to Ross, and then go home, have dinner. How are you, Kill? I'm fine. You're looking very sporty chic. <laughs> She's moved out from the grey tracksuit. <laughs> I love her. Excuse me, Erica. Did you tell them long about my grey tracksuit? No, they don't know about the grey tracksuit. She said this grey tracksuit that you oh, wore. <laughs> we now have a black one. Um, I just think what else I wore it a few days in a row. I can't talk. I've worn this grey top. I'd say yeah, you more than anything I wore last one. year. But you know what? Like, you I don't care. Yeah, like. of course. And like, it's the comfiest stuff. I mean, why, why would we be wearing things that are uncomfortable when we're at home? I'm gonna go home now, have my dinner, and then go back into that dressing gown later. And the Meghan Markle and Harry interviews on tonight, Ooh, so we're gonna see. watch that. I feel like I'm, I know what's gonna yeah, happen because I was on Twitter, Twitter all day. Already, yeah. Very juicy, but I want to see it in person, so I want to be like all ready, skincare, yeah. everything done by then. What time is that? Half nine. Yeah, half nine. I think it's not for two hours, like. Or was well, anyway in America. So yeah, that's the plan. Empty. I mean, I don't blame the people. It's very, very gloomy. Windy. Breathing in that fresh air for a minute. Come on, Vogie, get some fresh air. Good girl. Oh, she's so cute. She loves it too. Look at her little bomb. Breathe in, breathe out. 
All your worries will go away. I just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow old. Please tell me you'll stay or take me away. Back in the plaza dressing gown. I'm just about to take off my makeup. I'm gonna do my skincare. These are my usuals and my cleansers in the bathroom. So I'm gonna cleanse and then do my HA intensifier serum, my Kiehl's what's it called creamy eye treatment with avocado. This is really nice. And then I'm gonna put a big dose of this on my face because my skin feels a little bit dry. And this always helps. I always feel better the next day. And then we're gonna chill and watch the documentary. It's on. I'm really interested to watch this. Okay, whoa, that was a juicy, juicy interview. Let me know in the comments if you watched it as well and what you thought of it. And also, I'm going to comment below the winner of the giveaway from my last video, the little skincare set. So if you entered that, check the comments and see if you maybe were the lucky one. I'll leave all my details and everything to contact me so I can get your address and I'll get that sent out and I'll definitely do more giveaways as well. Keep an eye out now on my videos over the coming weeks and I'll like gather up some more stuff for you as a little treat. But anyway, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already, it really helps my channel and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.